Hello and good evening all. This is mainly about my disgust at the NFL and how they're going to go woke. They're getting woke and they're going broke. Uh, this is going to piss off so many people. And you thought the kneeling thing caused a lot of fans not to watch? This will cause a lot of fans not to watch the NFL. Anyone that thought about going back, they will not go back. Uh, but before I get to how the NFL is now shitting on the United States again, uh, could you please hit the like button and subscribe? So, uh, this is what's happening. The NFL is going to play the Black National Anthem before the American National Anthem at all the games in the first week. This is going to piss off so many people. Uh, yeah, NFL, you're going to go woke. And I have no sympathy for you. The NFL will reportedly play Lift Every Voice and Sing, which is also known as the Black National Anthem, before every week when NFL game in the 2020 season, according to ESPN. The, season, the decision to play the song comes following the death of Floyd, which led to the nationwide protest for racial inequality and police brutality. And you should also add in riots and insurrection. According to the, ES, to the ESPN report, the song will be played before the Star Stangle Banner, which is also going to piss off a lot of people. Many players have been vocal about the stance on this to topic. Washington Redskins running back Adrian P Peterson, Arizona Cardinals quarterback Colin Murray and Cleveland Browns quarterback Baker Mayfield already have said that they will kneel for the national anthem. And um, maybe we should just pull all the cops out of it, take away the flyby, and let uh, people know you're going there, you're going there with no type of protection from the United States if they're going to do that. The league and the NFL Players Association also can comp um, thinking, listing the names of the victims on the uniforms through decals on helmets and patches on jersey is PN reported. And I bet it'll only be black names and will not view anyone else who got killed because they're racist. The NFL also may produce educational programs about the victims. They may they also may have other plans that have not been identified. The league hopes to demonstrate a genuine commitment to the public players and coaches and that the players' voices continue to be heard according to ESPN's thoughts. NFL Commissioner Roger Goodell put out a video last month admitting that the league was wrong for not listening to the players who knelt during the National Anthem to protest. Uh, but you won't listen to the fans who fucking pay you guys. Yeah, you're going, you're getting... You're going woke, you're getting woke, and you're going to go broke. You're going to screw over all the fans. You don't care about the fans. All you care is about that small minority that's going to loot and shit. This is why sports are turning into namby pamby bullshit. You're there to play, not for politics. You want to be in politics, get out of sports and get into politics. Why don't you let me know what you guys think about it, and will you be watching the NFL? I will not. I'm going to let my friends know about this. This is bullshit. And if you made it this far, could you hit the like button and subscribe if you like what I'm doing? And as always, everyone, be good, have fun, stay safe. Bye-bye.